Okay guys, this is our BMW 3 Series from 2006. It's a 318, it's an E90 um, 3 Series saloon. Purpose of this video is to show you the live data coming from the vehicle here. Uh, we're using the launch Seaweed Professional CRP123. Um, and we're just going to go in and show you how to obtain the live data and also show you uh, the live data graphing as well. Um, so what we want to do is cl click onto the OBD2 or a OBD screen. Uh, we'll go through and find the correct protocol to communicate with the vehicle. Incidentally you can pick up this tool just by clicking the link directly below this video. Alright so what we want to do is click on data stream and first of all we'll click on view all items so it's basically going to show us um, all of the available items in the vehicle that we can get the live data from. Um, so as you can see here, it's giving us different values, engine coolant temperature, and we scroll through just by clicking the down button and it gives us lots of different uh, values. The, v the engine has just been started so the values will probably change um, as the engine gets a bit warmer. Uh, but we can see the live data there for the engine RPM for example uh, fluctuating because that's generally what it does, it will fluctuate. Um, and if I put my foot on the gas, you'll see it fluctuates even higher there. Alright, so we'll just scroll through a few more here. that is it. So that's the different live data that you'll get. Now what you can also do is view graphic items. Um, you can view graphing items uh, for all of the um, scenarios and bits of information that we've just seen there but what, what, you, what also you can do is you can choose which bits of information you want to put together on the graph. So say for example we want to put together the engine coolant temperature we want to put together the engine RPM and we want to put together say we'll go absolute throttle position so we we'll click escape and then here we have our three different bits of information so the ECT, the RPM and the throttle position there so each has its own colour and what I can do is I'll put a bit of gas on so the RPM which is the black and the throttle position which are going to shoot up the engine coolant temperature is gradually going up as well it's max is 54 um, and then you can see it's sort of fluctuating back down to the bottom here for the, the RPM and the throttle position. Of course, it gives you live readings as well. So this vehicle, the, uh, the standard position is 2.4%. Uh, but that's just basically giving you an idea. You can see that's gone up now as well. Uh, you see it's giving you an idea of what the, uh, the graphing and the data stream can do. And this is the launch uh, Seaweeder Professional CRP123. Uh, it is available just by clicking the link directly below this video. Um, it's excellent also for, it works in a lot of other vehicles. It works for uh, most European vehicles and Asian vehicles. Make sure you check the list. Um, but it's also good for clearing faults, uh, diagnosing any faults, diagnosing and clearing any dashboard lights. Say for example, you've got the engine warning light, ABS light, airbag warning light um, or transmission uh, it's good for any of those systems and it will diagnose and uh, read the faults for those particular uh, systems so as I say it's the Seaweed Professional it's available just by clicking the link directly below this video thanks for watching this video